Hey everybody and welcome. It's Practice Adam from Practice Dummy Gaming and I'm here to talk to you about the Liza P demo. So I've been playing this demo a little bit. I've gotten past the first boss and really enjoying what's uh, what I'm seeing here. Love the art style, music, the whole feel of the game in this Victorian area era. Um, running around as Pinocchio, uh, sort of a badass Pinocchio, uh, taking out other reanimated puppets that have gone awry. Um, turns out to be a really fun concept. And the combat I find really satisfying, as well as um, just the storyline so far. I've made it as far as the Crowd Hotel. My next mission is heading out there to see if I can find Geppetto. But uh, if you're interested in Souls Likes, if you've played a few games like Wolong Fallen Dynasty or Bloodborne, uh, you'll be really familiar with the mechanics here. Um, especially relating back to Wolong Fallen Dynasty, which I've played a lot of lately. Um, it, parrying is really important as opposed to some of the earlier soul likes where it was all about dodge and, and getting around behind a character. Uh, in these newer souls likes like Wu Long and now Liza P, parrying is your main mechanic, trying to deflect and defend and open them up to attacks in the front. Um, so, you know, big learning curve here, like any souls like, there's not a lot of guidance. You get in there, you pick your um your class yeah, there's three different classes dexterity strength and agility uh, i picked the strength class because i generally take a lot of damage and a lot of hits uh hence the name practice dummy gaming um and uh you know i find for me it just helps with survival and also when i do get those hits in i do a lot of damage so um really interesting game uh, i'm really enjoying what i'm seeing here and uh, i really recommend it i can't wait for the full release Hopefully you guys follow me along. I'll do some more videos coming up. I've gotten as far as taking out uh, Parade Master, the first boss, and uh, some more videos coming soon. will show you my progress as the, I deal with the two other bosses in the demo. Um, once those are, are defeated, I'll post those videos with some commentary. Hopefully you enjoy what you're seeing and, and join me for the rest of uh, the full release when it comes out September 19th. First boss and Liza P, uh, Grave Master, and I just wanted to show this fight because it highlights some great mechanics of uh, this game. Um, you can see that I'm really trying to focus on parrying attacks and then avoiding some larger attacks taking the range. Uh, I don't do a great job in this video of avoiding damage. You can see at the end of it here, um, Parade Master and I were one hit away from killing each other, and whoever landed that last blow was going to win the fight. Uh, luckily, I, uh, I got that last strike in uh, before I had to attempt this boss one more time. Um, what I wanted to talk about here is just the importance of parrying and avoiding damage. Uh, if you're coming off a wall long like I, uh, I have been, um, the combat is a lot less frantic, a lot more methodical. And I'm kind of enjoying that as opposed to just trying to defend quickly and attack quickly like you do a whole lot. Um, so this fun, this fight's a ton of fun. There's a couple of phases. 
his range extends in the second phase, so watch out for that. And if you're watching this video closely, you can see I miss a number of parries and dodges. Uh, pick that strength class, like I mentioned off the top, for survivability. I never use a heavy attack in this fight. I only use light attacks. I'm parrying, dodging, and then moving in when I have an opening to strike, uh, to get those light attack strikes in. Um, I found that worked really well for me. So. I uh, hope uh, you guys can follow along for full release of this game, September 19th. I do plan on progressing further, and I will post a few more videos of my progress through the demo. There's two more bosses, and I have to find Geppetto. So keep an eye on Practice Dummy Gaming. Come on back for more. Hopefully we'll see you, see you soon.